With all the things about our lives that we've laid bare on our hard drives, many of us have done a woefully bad job of protecting the things that are for our eyes only. I mean, sure, you can put a password on your computer, but Windows passwords are notoriously easy to get around, and if you share a PC with family members, coworkers, or roommates, there is often very little to keep them from rifling through your private files. So what's the security conscious user to do? There are actually hardware level, whole drive encryption solutions, but these are mostly designed to keep an attacker from getting into your data when switching the computer on or from just physically ripping out your drive and walking away with it. Once you log into the OS, the entire drive is decrypted, meaning that sharing a computer with someone or just walking away from it while it's turned on becomes a big security risk. This is where the ability to encrypt individual files and directories can really help. And possibly the most straightforward way to do this is with file system level encryption. On Windows, this takes the form of a baked-in technology uncreatively called Encrypting File System, or EFS, which works with NTFS, the main file system used by modern Windows versions for the desktop. Here's how it works. EFS allows you to encrypt a file or directory simply by checking a box on its properties window. Once you click OK, it uses standard public key cryptography, which you can learn more about here, to encrypt the file or folder with a generated key called an FEK. This key itself then is encrypted as well with a public key unique to that particular user. And finally, the encrypted FEK is stored in the file's header. When the user wants to go back and access it later, it's decrypted with the user's private key, and this is all done seamlessly and transparently, so you won't be continuously prompted for keys or passwords. As long as you're logged in under the account, the encryption is tied to. The nice thing about this paradigm, as opposed to whole drive encryption, is that it's much more difficult for other users logged in under their own accounts to peek at your files. But before you go rushing off to encrypt all the embarrassing stuff you've filled your drive with over the years, remember that EFS does not obviate the need for a strong Windows account password. A weak password not only makes it easier for an attacker to log into your account, but it also weakens the encryption on the files themselves. As the cryptographic keys that Windows generates to do the actual encrypting are based on your password. So make sure you pick a strong password as we discussed in this video. But if you don't feel like having all your data available after login is secure enough, and you want another layer that asks for some kind of verification when you try to access a file or folder, you might want to consider various third-party encryption tools. Although these usually aren't as seamless or sexy as file system level encryption, they might provide you with a bit more peace of mind as they aren't tied to your login and can offer more options, such as stronger encryption algorithms or the ability to create things like hidden virtual drives to make it exceptionally difficult for snoops to uncover your secrets. But whichever method you choose to secure your individual files, the most robust solution is to combine it with hardware-based whole disk encryption to frustrate multiple kinds of attacks. After all, think about the humiliation you could suffer if someone found those sappy letters to your ex that you forgot to delete. Additionally, if you're looking to take your sappy letters to your ex with you on the road, how about an encrypted USB flash drive to protect it from prying eyes? The Kingston encrypted USB flash drive provides high-level security with 256-bit AES hardware-based encryption. USB 3 support means you don't have to compromise on transfer speeds for top-notch security, and for additional peace of mind, the drive locks down and reformats itself after 10 intrusion attempts.
You can also upgrade your drive with built-in antivirus protection and remote management features. And if you're curious about the other secure USB options that Kingston has, they have encrypted USB drives for all levels of security from entry laid, entry laid? That's a mix between level and grade. Entry level, all the way up to government and military grade construction and certification. So check them out at the link in the video description. So thanks for watching guys, like, dislike, check out our other channels, comment with video suggestions, and subscribe! Subscribe dance. Let's do a new dance move, can you do something else? That is a new dance move. No, you've been doing that for- I have not!